Hey guys, it's Makita from Urban Family Gardens. I'm just relaxed and zinned out and I really enjoyed my workout today. And today, I'm really looking forward to hanging out with you guys for a little while. What we're gonna do is plant Oh, that's what I do when I'm getting ready to garden. I kind of set the vibe. Like I said, be intentional with your gardening. I set a vibe. If it's like a spiritual vibe or a, a, a zen, jazzy vibe, I, I just try to set a vibe for the day. So this particular vibe is Cleo Soul. Um, why don't you? She is so bomb, but you should check it out. Um, and so anyway, back to business. Right now, we are getting ready to plant some ginger. Let me show you. Okay, guys. This is some ginger that I bought from the store. And um, it's an organic ginger. So what I'm going to do is plant it in the soil so that I can grow it. And then that way I'll be able to have it all season long, all winter long. I can make ginger powder. I can put it in my foods. I can make so many different things from this. And, ooh, I wish you could smell it. It smells so good. So actually, ginger is not a root. It's a rhizome. So that means um, the, the, the flower or the plant, it's going to grow from this up. So with ginger, when it grows, make sure you find a container that's elongated because the ginger grows long. Then that way you'll give room for it to grow. And then as the ginger grows underground, the rhizome grows underground and your, your beautiful plants come up, you can reach under like, you know, every at the end of every growing, growing season um, and grab you some ginger and break it off and leave the remainder growing on. So anyway, that's your ginger. It smells so good. And what I'm gonna do is I've got this planter. Boop, boop, boop. I use it a lot of times um, to plant things that are wide or broad, broad spread. So what I'm gonna do now is clear the space out. I've already added some nutrition to it. And I'm not gonna want this. You can soak this in water if you'd like to, but I'm not gonna soak it in water today. Um, I had it soaking on yesterday. And basically what's gonna happen is you're looking for ginger when you're at the store or whatever. Grab, of course, enough for you and your family. But you're looking for these little nodes. That's where, that's where everything's gonna start to sprout for them. And you want a big enough piece so you can give it room to really, really take off. So I'm gonna take this ginger and I'm gonna stick it in the soil. And you really wanna only plant it, you know how a lot of bulbs and stuff, you plant it really deep in the ground. With ginger, you only really wanna plant it about um, one inch deep. And um, you can make it be like one to two inches deep. Now that I've got that planted in there, I'm gonna add a little water, and this is rain water. That's why I love, 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 I pretty much try to preserve everything <laughs> so I leave a lot of my flowering pots out here on my planter table so that they can pitch, pick up the natural rain that comes and then I've always got water to water my flowers so we're gonna add a little water to this guy and there you go ginger planet ta-da so I am gonna keep this guy, it'll probably go, because it makes such a beautiful sprout, I'll probably replace it with the centerpiece that is on my dining, I mean my um, back porch table. And I'll have beautiful ginger sprouts because it also sprouts a flower as well, which is edible. So anyway, ginger is good for your immune system. It's also good for specialty times like now. You can make a great ginger tea. And how I usually do it is take it and shred it up. Or I'll do like a green tea or an herbal tea. And I'll add ginger to it, shred it up with a mincer into my tea as well as lemon as well as a little honey and you've got a nice and sometimes I put a little brandy in it and then you and then you have a nice um, little um, tea that is good and soothing for you and also abusing your immune system and um, depleting the mucus in your body so anyway I wanted to share this with you guys I will keep you posted how this guy grows and um, one more thing I'm gonna share with you today because I told you we're gonna hang out a little bit I want to share with you guys um, um, 
why I started gardening and a little more about me, my family. I am from a family of gardeners, so I can't wait to share that with you guys. Have a good evening. Bye. It's not an evening. We still got some time to go this morning time, y'all. I just got started a little early. Bye.